Hey, it's Dr. Amanda with Straight Smile Solutions, straightsmilesolutions.com, and today we're going to talk about finishing cases with various little appliances, both custom and semi-custom. We're going to talk about two different companies. One of them is TP. The other one is Healthy Start. You can see I'm using a ton of acronyms here. That is purposefully because one of these companies is very litigious and not very nice to me for no reason. Um, and I really, really even hating, hate making content to give them business because that's really not my goal. But of the stuff they make is actually pretty good and useful. So I am making this video upon request of one doctor that reached out to me and asked this question. Begrudgingly, I'm making this video. Let's put it that way. But it actually is a good video. Okay, so let's talk about TP versus HS, what their menu of services are, and how you can use them um, to help your cases. So let's start first with the OG company that is TP. TP is a company that is based in, I believe, South Bend, Indiana. It's been around since the 40s. It is a family-based company. That means it was owned by one family member who passed it down to their next family member, and they tend to employ a lot of family members. Um, very nice people. Um, I have met them. I spent, goodness, was it 2018 or 2019 AAO hanging out in their booth? I was helping them with some lectures and stuff. So it was pretty cool. Um, that is that. So they have two major products. One of them is a custom, I call it custom mini positioner. The other one is a pre-finisher. So you can see here in this photo, this is the pre-finisher. So let's take you down a little bit of orthodontic history. So unless you're over age 55 or 60, you may not be, or unless you're an orthodontist, you probably aren't familiar with their products because you probably wouldn't have used them. But I've known about their products for decades. So way, way back when, when you did braces on a patient in the 60s, 70s, or even early 80s, I can tell you my husband was one of these patients because he's a lot older than me. And he had braces, I think in the late 70s actually. When he had braces way back when, there was no ability to glue braces onto a teeth. So braces were attached to a metal band, which you put spacers in between every teeth, not even just molars, but premolars and incisors and they were custom banged down, hammered down onto the tooth, and that's what moved the tooth. So when you finish the treatment and you remove those bands from every single tooth, so you can see here in this picture, these are glued, right? Imagine no glue, imagine just a circular band that went around even the front teeth, right? So that's why they call them trade track mounts. They're really uncomfortable, really painful, and really ugly. Slowly, as the technology evolved, they were able to, at least on the front teeth, get glued on braces and the back teeth had the bands. I can tell you when I had braces in 1991, um, I had bands on all my premolars and molars, but my front six teeth top and bottom had braces. So I was kind of in the middle. Um, but basically, when you finished a case, a braces case, you had itty bitty micro spaces in between every single teeth, front and back, and that's not good, right? Because it's a flat track, it's a food trap, it's a perio trap. So you had to close those spaces. You couldn't just go straight into retainers easily. So a lot of times they would make a rubbery appliance that looked like a football mouth guard that the patient would wear for a few months that would help to close the spaces. And that's what a positioner is. So TP has two major products. One is, like I said, is a pre-finisher. A pre-finisher is, is semi-custom, meaning that they have 30, 40, 50 different sizes that you can stock. There's common sizes and you can actually measure with a little ruler. And I don't even know if I think they can do it even with a scan and they can tell you which size would fit the patient best. Price point, I think, and don't quote me on this, is around 90, 100 ish. I think less if you buy the kit, less if you buy in bulk. And basically at Debon, take the braces off or take the Invisalign away, give them one of these suckers that fits them. They wear this about 14 to 16 hours a day. They try to chew around on it during the day. They don't have to wear it at work. They don't have to wear it in school. And that could either become their full-time retainer, which is nothing wrong with that. It's gonna help with airway, having a one unit retainer. Or later you can swap it out for some Essex Winch All. Everything settles, um, you get all the irregularities, the bite is better and everything like that. So pretty cool. Um, the other option, if you've got like strange anatomy or if you want it like perfect, perfect is the semi custom, which is actually made the way they made it in the old fashioned days where it's actually articulated. It's on a mount. It's custom made for that patient. If you can, if you are a dentist, you probably remember this in, um, pros lab, you know, when you did dentures, you would mount the case and you would wax up the teeth and, and, and everything like that. It's like that, you know, they're gonna try to wax it up so you have perfect occlusion, perfect bite, perfect tripod contacts and everything like that. And that's what they're doing. And then they're gonna make this silicone rubbery mold that goes around the teeth. They can do it in different colors, all kind of fun bling. And 
it is actually made for your teeth. Now, my son had one of those um, instead of aligners and boom, and he never needed aligners or braces. So it's just so minor what he needed after we fixed his bite that we made him a TP Custom Mini. So price point on the Custom Mini is unlike the pre-finisher, which is semi-custom, like I said, you can buy off the shelf in a variety of different sizes and it fits most patients, 80 to 90%, you get a good result with that. But um, the Custom Mini is about 300-ish, maybe a little bit more. Um, and it will take a month or two. This is just based on my report. I believe TP says it takes three weeks, but doctors are telling me it takes a month or two to actually get. But um, everyone really likes it when you get one of those. And again, this could be your final retainer if you wanted it to, or you could just wear it till things are perfect and make an Essex over that. But anyways, so that's TP, um, the original. So basically just to give you more, if you're kind of geeking out on history of dentistry, um, I can tell you that Invisalign modeled their product and of course all the others, the winner companies after them, off TP's product, you know, that we use in the 40s, 50s, 60s, and orthodontists, when they are trying to do a board case, now board is optional. I mean, obviously you don't have to do your nerdy boards to be an orthodontist. Um, a lot of people do it just because they like to be cool. I don't think it's cool, I think it's stupid. But in any case, <laughs> sorry, it's egotistical. But um, everyone I know who's done it is has an ego, but uh, that's just me. Um, I like to go against the grain. I know I can finish a case great. I don't need to brag about it in order to do it. But um, if you want to take your actual hands on board in St. Louis, um, pretty much everybody, they're all cheating anyways. They're all buying these custom minis to finish their cases. That's how we did them, you know, in residency and everything. So boom, this has been, it's a cheat basically. It's been around forever, but um, yeah. That's, that's the cool thing about TP. Like I said, cool company, nice family owned company based in Indiana. Okay. Always support local, right? All right. Whereas we have another company, which I'm not as fond as not that their products are bad or anything like that. It's just that we have a little beef going back and forth about five years old. I'm not going to go into that. Cause like I said, they're highly litigious and for whatever reason they hate me. So, but they really shit it. Cause I have probably given them close to a million dollars worth of business over the years because I actually think their products are good. And it's really unfortunate that they act like that. But you know, sometimes people have behavioral issues. So um, another family owned company, sometimes family owned companies are good, sometimes they're bad. I'm just gonna leave it like that. But um, anyways, this is Orthotain Healthy Start and I'm purposely using acronyms here, right? So I actually really like a lot of their products and I have a lot of videos and they're all positive on their products. Um, you know, they do require you to take a class to be certified. That's their choice. Okay. So whereas TP, you can just go ahead and order. Anyone can order. You don't have to take a class. How they start. You have to take a class. It's a couple thousand dollars. Sometimes they're promos. I used to teach the classes. So I'm very familiar with the classes, right? Um, you will learn something from the classes. Eh, you probably, if you watch my videos, you'll learn the same stuff, but I mean, it's just airway and, and, you know, myofunctional stuff and, and you know, toggle position and growth and modification and things like that. But you know, if you don't know this stuff, it, it's a good idea. Um, and then you have the ability to prescribe their appliances, which I actually think some of their appliances are very innovative and the only, they're quite patented. So no one else has them. I mean, there's some copycats, but I'll be honest, they're not as good. So, um, the one thing I really like that they make is they have their habit correctors. So that's the HCs, um, which come in toddler sizes, kids sizes, adult sizes. And they're really bar none. That's these suckers here. They're really good at, at getting rid of habits. You know, if, I mean, obviously if you can afford an OMT and oral myofunctional therapist, no need this, right? But OMTs are expensive. Trust me, I'm going through OMT therapy right now. Could I have worn a habit corrector? Uh, probably not because I needed to stretch my freedom and I needed a frenioplasty and stuff like that. So I really did actually need the OMT. But if it's just like a habit and a kid, it's easy to retrain with an HC as long as they're actually wearing it every night for a couple of years, right? I mean, the thing about Healthy Start is that their products are a marathon, not a sprint. You're not going to do it in one month, two months. It's going to take years and years and years to get rid of habits and to retrain. And, you know, and sometimes you have to pair it with expanders, in my opinion, and other stuff to make it perfect, but it is definitely a start. Um, HCs are somewhere in the neighborhood of 100-ish, so pretty similar to the cost of the pre-finisher. Like I said, they're semi-custom. They come in a couple different sizes. Um, they also have a, some other products that are very similar to the pre-finishers in that they're also semi-custom. They have nothing custom, so nothing is custom, unlike TP. They only have everything semi-custom, which is nice. Um, they have their N's and their G's and their IG's. So N's are their adult version of the pre-finisher. Very similar, material feels a little bit different, but very similar, okay? 
Um, which one do I think is better? Eh, I mean, on adults, I don't really care. It's all about the same. On kids, you the TP is not meant for kids. They don't have kids' products. I mean, yes, you can take their their um, pre finishers and you can modify them to wear them for kids. I have definitely done that before. Um, there are ways to do that, um, but. If you're already a Healthy Start certified, I'd say just buy their G's because their G's are, are really, 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 really good. I had both my kids in G's um, and they're great appliances. As a matter of fact, they are my favorite appliance. And if I ever went back to practicing full time, I would probably be giving G's to if I could order them separate and not in the whole treatment plan, which is kind of my other beef with them and that some doctors are able to order things a la carte. Some doctors have to order the whole treatment plan. I get the point, but sometimes we like to use things the way we like to use them and that's part of being a doctor and we don't want the whole series like I want to do say Invisalign first with MA and then I might want to go into a G for retention until I'm ready for phase two but they make you buy the whole series which is upwards six to eight hundred dollars with the treatment plan I don't need a treatment plan I'm orthodontist please don't have one of your doctors who's less qualified to me tell me how to do things right come on man i'm not paying for that so um you know definitely had some issues with certain type of things and i i think i would promote them a heck of a lot more if they got rid of that but um in any case now you know but yes they do have appliances to help you finish cases is what it's coming down to but i think it's a lot better for younger kids than for adults but it's there you know and if you want to get better occlusion and things like that you can definitely consider using either their ends or their g appliances but i think their habit correctors are great so anyways as always with any video if one of these two companies doesn't like what i posted which i think is kind of stupid because a i'm allowed to have my own opinion and everything i say is true but um i always can take it down you don't have to send me a letter from your attorney requiring me to take your stuff down because hey then i really won't talk about your products anymore and you're gonna lose out so um and i won't recommend them to my doctors but in any case all right i'm gonna leave this up as a test and see how long it stays up take care